Yo, 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 everybody. Generic B here, and welcome to a brand new series, How to Survive 2 Electric Boogaloo. So, um, if you guys don't know, I am on vacation. I am uh, with my beautiful bride and my mother-in-law. We are in Rome right now, uh, celebrating my mother-in-law's 70th anniversary and my 16th wedding anniversary. Woo! So, uh, in the meantime, I thought, let's just play a little fun game. Give you guys something uh, new and new and goofy. And this is, I played a couple uh, couple levels of this and it's, it's not too shabby, actually. Uh, so, let's go right in. Let's do local game. I'm going to do a brand new camp. Just to show you guys, um, I am using an Xbox controller and it is much, much better than using mouse and keyboard to me. All right, so we start off, here's our dude. And uh, it'll show you like positions marked on the map so you can like go around, you hold the, or hit the select key for that. But we're gonna talk to Kovac. Hey there, stranger. Don't be afraid. I don't bite. I don't bite. And to see that my message helped get you here safe and sound. Safe old. I'm Kovac, delighted to meet Sounds like every single one of my people I know in Bulgaria. You'll have to forgive me for this somewhat distant welcome. Uh -huh. We both know that these days, unpleasant encounters are a dime a dozen. A dime a dozen. Even though I get the feeling there is a bit of electricity between us, no. I figure we should get to know each other one step at a time. See if we can work together. Sound good? Yes. So, let's get this thing underway. All right, so we have to do this uh, first little mission, and which basically is like go to the go to the forest, right? And let's hit start. Now, <clears throat> the first how to survive, I I played a little bit and I didn't really enjoy it, um, but I played, and then I I downloaded the oh there's something right there, big piece of wood. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave that for right now. Then I played, they came up with a a version where it became like kind of third person and it was really terrible. And so, uh, <laughs> and so I was like, oh, okay, somewhat resources can be collected. Backpack holds everything you pick up. Yep, yep. Um, oh, medicinal herb. Yes, that's what we were trying to go for. Uh, so that one was terrible. This one doesn't seem so bad. That's why I played a couple rounds before I decided to record just to make sure because I didn't want to start a, uh, you know, a mini series if it was completely awful. Down you go, mama. If you're quick enough, you can get these guys before they take you, take you down. And you can, um, you can grab stuff around as you can see. Ooh. Okay, there's, there's a couple over there. We're supposed to kill five of these things. Ooh, that was nice how we did that. How did I manage that wonderful maneuver? Okay, I'm just waiting for my stamina to go up and... I have... Oh, oh! And one for you, old man! Okay. You're fine. Piece of cloth coins. You got nothing. Ooh, what do we got there? Nylon thread. Okay. And of course, you scavenge as you go. Now, the first one, uh, which I didn't play much of at all, but apparently the first one was much more open world about, uh, than this one. And some people are not really super thrilled that this one is more kind of mission based and level based. I actually think it's kind of cool. I like it. It, it makes it a tiny bit different. Oh, see, he almost bumped me. All right, so now we, now we have a choice. We can go uh, back and finish. I just want to grab Oh, he got me a little bit. I just want to grab a couple more things that I saw. These big pieces of wood, I don't. I just don't know about at this moment. Okay, we're done. Let's go. So we finish. We've killed our, our five. This is just the, uh, you know, the initial mission, so they're a little bit easy. You know how it goes. You know me, I love zombie games. Here, let's... We've accumulated tons of experience points. It's almost indecent. Don't, uh, if you don't spend them, uh, you'll 
risk losing them if you get the bad idea to up and die. Use them to raise level your survivor or camp or to purchase upgrades. Don't be a cheapskate. Okay, actually, let's let's check that out. So I think that's it. Um, if we say upgrades, so how many things do we have? Okay, we have 1240 XP. Increases the damage you inflict. That seems to be a great one. Can I not use it? Oh, level required two. Slows down the rate at which the hunger gauge decreases. I'm going to wait until I'm level two because I want to up that melee expert. Cardio training. Oh, reduces energy consumption. Consumption. Great hearing. Increase the damage when using a bow or a crossbow, which we don't have right yet. Now we're gonna keep. We're gonna keep it. Okay, let's talk to the guy. Not bad for a rookie. Uh -huh. His style was a bit unpolished, but I can see you've got potential. Thank you. Anyway, I think you just convinced me to welcome you, New Kovac City. New Kovac City. Sure of the name yet. What do you think? I'm sort of hesitating between a Kovac grad or maybe Kovac. <laughs> I want a name that's really unified and well. Anyway. We can think about it later. Okay, so now, don't be afraid. So, first time in the city. Seeing as how we are now friends, I guess I should open the door to my humble refuge and introduce myself. Don't yes, move. you should. I'll unlock it right here. Uh huh. Hmm. Interesting. I can we can find a way to fix this goddamn <laughs> door. Okay. <laughs> Alaskar, new friend. Now, if he can go find something to fix it in town. All right, so we got to go find a little bit of oil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of, lot of talking. Okay, so our next, our next one, less talking, more, more rocking. Uh, so the next, we go into the city and find a bottle of oil, so we can, uh, so we can grease the wheels of the door and get into the shelter. All right, so before we do that, though, uh, let's go into crafting. So we can make a small dressing with, uh, oh man, if we had gotten a, a stick, we could have made the silencer. So here's the type of things we can do. If we had a saw, we could make, oh yeah, we can make a simple arrow for the bows. Oh, that's good to know, but we don't have a machete yet. Um, but what we can make are these things. So let's All right, so we've got that we have made some small dressings, which will be <clears throat> a little bit better Than um, than just using the medicinal herbs herbs and Then let's go see if we can find ourselves Get wrecked I, I, dang it. We have to upgrade our weapon too if at all possible Uh. <clears throat> So that's our goal. Ooh. <laughs> Come here, pal. You want a piece of me? Let's see if we can do this. Uh, uh. Yes. Hiya, hiya. <laughs> that's pretty good. Okay. Ooh, I do see something. What do we have there? I can climb up into it. Oh, box of nails. Yes. Okay. Uh, so quickly. Did you see that guy over in the corner? <laughs> that was excellent. So we'll make that inventory. So now we have one of these baseball bats and we put it in our hand. Life is good. Paving stone. Okay, I don't know what a paving stone is for, but we have one now. Hey, pal. Ooh. Okay, so now it takes, ooh, now it takes three hits. I wonder what I would use coins for. Must be used for something. Okay, still no, still no oil. Oh, Pecker, he's a fast one. And just so I have it on my bar. Okay, come here, pal. The, the UI is actually, it's, it's not too shabby, I gotta say. And the, and the controls are pretty good when you're on a, when you're on a controller. I'm not hating this. Oh, here comes a guy. And I kind of like how 
Like, I'll show you when I move behind this bus. See? It kind of makes it to where... Where you can, like, see behind it. I like how they make it kind of disappear. Alright, let's go... Yep. Boom. Boom. Hmm. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, you guys got anything? Nothing. Have to keep an eye out because you never know when you might get some. Oh, are those guys gonna jump? Yes, they are. Oh, Pecker. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Did not realize they were gonna jump off that. <clears throat> they should. They should. Uh. Oh, run. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right, let's try that. Oh, oh, you can hold it down and get like a massive swing on it. That's not bad at all. Okay, let's hop in here. See, graphics aren't the best, but it fits. Oh, we're another one. I like that. All right, what do we have here? Ooh, chocolate bar, yes, please. A lead figurine and some orange juice. He did say to try to get some, oh, aluminum tube. He did say to try to get some uh, some food and drink while we were gone, while we're out. So we will do some of that. And let's see what's up here. Box of nails, thank you. Can of peas, thank you. Okay, here's something. Bottle of water. Is there a guy up here? There's something over here. Nylon thread, yes. Another box of nails. Nylon thread. Okay, is there any? Oh, I hear him. Okay, they're down there. There's a dude down there. Okay, let's go. Let's keep on trucking. He, I'm sure he smells me. Oh, hey, little pal. Oh, oh, I knew it. I knew you were gonna get me. And, Ooh, oh yeah, work it, girl. Wiggle. Wow, they sure got you, survivor. I should use some stuff. Okay, I will. So let's hold down the L button. Boom. Look at you. <laughs> I love video game physics. It's the funniest stuff ever. All right, anything of value around here? Nope. Okay, we got one dude. Yep. And... Oh, baby! Home run. Okay, let's see if we can time that a little bit better. Oh, yes. I love it. Medicinal herbs. Huh? And hold it. Oh, I thought it'd be too close. Piece of cloth, piece of cloth, some white shroud flower, whatever that malarkey is. Oh, this has got potential for some, okay, paving stone. Hey, pal. Ooh. And does not look like there's anything else around. Okay, you can also do a little run job. It slowly reduces your... Okay, that wasn't the greatest idea in the world, but it worked. <laughs> I love it, oops, here we go. Okay, got a piece of cloth, got a piece of cloth. So we're, we're clothed out for days. I think we do eventually have to worry about how much we're carrying on us, but so far it seems all right. Uh-oh, uh-oh, okay. So that sound is probably like, like all the bad guys know about me, so we might be getting a quote-unquote zombie horde. Oh, missed, Pecker. Nicely done. He couldn't get past the, the pole. 
Push. Swing, better, better, swing. For the fences. Okay, let's go in here. Okay, oh, yeah. Oh, that was close. And. Ooh. Oh, there's bunches of stuff in here. Bottle of oil. We got a bottle of oil. Okay. All right, let's see what else we can get while we're here before we before we call it uh, a success. Oh, hello, legs. Before we call it a successful run. Because I'm sure there's mo better stuff around here to get. Not up here, but oh, there's something over there. Okay, let's. Oh, take your coins. Let's go down this way. Did I not see a guy? Oh, there's a guy right there. And. Oh, I missed him. Missed him again. Okay, so now I saw something over here that I wanted to check. If you kind of get in, you can see there's some something, something right there. Ah, okay, we can open up a door. Bits and pieces of lead? Orange juice? Anything of value over there? No? Lead figurine, nylon thread. That lead has gotta be, like, I bet we turned it into bullets or something. Okay, nothing there. And a paving stone. Okay, this seems pretty good. Let's, let's jump on out. Let's do our quit jab. They quit our jabs. And now what? Hey, there's a dude over here. What are you doing here, dude? Oh, I missed him. What? How I miss? Okay, I can't hit that guy. Come a little closer, would you? Oh, okay, he's 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 invisible. Great. You found something. Oh. Okay, he said, "Let's get in." Oh, okay, that is a problem. So, oh, this is cool. Check out our bunker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, and we're supposed to talk to him I imagine dude do you think these are like zombie hamster wheel generators oh that's not too shabby oh here he is here we go oh yeah look he's got cameras and stuff oh what's past there oh I can walk through here what do you have aluminum cans oh he's got some stuff over there let's go check it Nylon thread. Ooh. Eight million. Oh. Oh, machete. Yes. Cool. We needed a machete. All right. So we're going to talk to that guy. First improvements. I've already told you how dangerous it is if you don't drink or eat when you're in hostile territory. Oh, I haven't eaten or drank anything. That's right. But there's something else that's at least as dangerous. Negative thinking and a lack of prospects. Mm. To guard against that, so you're feeling all right, and so you can upgrade your equipment, you need a camp. Yeah. And every camp worthy of the name has a trunk, even an ugly one. Without one, you can't store what you find here and there. Yeah, that's true. So, I'll explain how to build your very own trunk. Okay. You're going to need wood, wood? rope, and fabric. Okay. Wood and fabric wood? you can find pretty much everywhere in the forest. Rope, on the other hand, is kind of hard to come by around here. I suggest you look for some in the swamp. Mm. There's always some lying around. Okay. Unless that old nutcase got there first and took everything. What nutcase? He goes wandering around the bog sometimes. Then he's not fighting with his brother. But whatever. Whatever. First, go and find what you need to make your trunk. And when you get back, you can make it and put it somewhere. 
Oh yeah, so that's kind of cool. All right, fellas, I am going to end the episode here. I know it's a little bit short, but uh, I want to make sure I get uh, some good episodes out for you guys while I'm on a vacation. Eh? Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you want to see more of this. If you do, be sure and leave a like. It does help me out so better, better much. You guys know. You know the drill. I uh, love you guys. Until next time, take care. Brush your hair. i see you when I see you. Peace. Ha <laughs> ha